Hi guys, it's me, Gordon from GW TV, and today we're going to do a little review of fitting some um, cab blinds by Creative Covers. So yeah, it's uh, been a little while since I did a video. Um, today we're going to do a bit of a review. Uh, these guys, Creative Covers, have sent me a, a little cab blind set. So these are blinds that go on the inside of your cab. So just firstly, a bit of a disclaimer. Um, these guys contacted me via Facebook and sent me a free set. They're not paying me to do um, like a positive review or anything. I said I'd do an honest review. Um, I'm going to get to keep these, but what I'm going to do is actually I'm going to put these up as like a little prize when we hit 5,000 subscribers. So a little bit more of that at the end. Um, but just so you know, I got these for free, but there it is. It's great to do a test on it. So let's have a little look at what you get in there. There is a set of instructions. So this is the little pack that it comes in. It's made of like a nice thick material. I think it's the same material as the blinds. And so in that bag, you get a little bag of fixings just there. And so there's a couple of poppers for each A pillar. And I'll show you those in a minute. And then you also get basically, um, I've got them just here. You get one blind, you can't really see because we're in the back of the van. You get one big blind that goes across the windscreen. And then you get one that clips on magnetically for both sides for the front windows and um, you would have seen before actually that I had a very similar product almost exactly the same actually by a different company called custom covers there's a video in my history you can go and find that um, and so it'd be interesting to see how this one holds up against that one so I've got experience with the other one um, and so we'll just quickly show how you sort of put all these on uh, and then I'll give you a little bit of feedback kind of um, what I think of them Okay, so firstly, I'm just going to show very quickly. This is one of the ones for the windows. I'll just show you popping it on really quick. So it's got magnets. I don't know if you can see, but there are magnets basically sewn in all around the edge. Um, it's a nice kind of stretchy fabric. Um, right, let's stick these on. There we go, look at that. That literally took, uh, what, a few seconds? Um, the good thing with these is, um, I, I'd say, compared to the other ones that I've done before, um, these ones have actually got a bit more giving them in regards to the stretch, but also um, they are um, a little bit longer. Like, the material overhangs a little bit, so that means I've got all this that I can tuck in underneath. The other ones came up very tight and short, actually. Um, so that's a winner there. And now I'll just show you doing the front one. Okay, so with this one, um, I'll just show you here. Again, it's a stretchy material. Then we get, and it's got these little hooks. I don't know if you can see this, but it's got a hook that just goes over the top there. And then on here, there are some poppers that you have to fit. Um, there's actually two. You use a two mil drill. can see that's popped in on that side and tuck that out there and then we just do the same on the other side okay and so what we're going to do now is we're just going to get this um, you can see it's got a popper at the top there's a popper at the top and there's a popper at the bottom and you use a two mil uh, drill bit you just literally put a little drill hole in here and then one down at the bottom um, and then you just screw in the poppers it literally takes a few minutes um, I've not done that for these ones because I already had the poppers in from the last set. They're actually in exactly the same place. Um, and so you just pop that on there. And that one on there. And then this just goes over the top. Just literally push that up like that. Same on the other side. So look at that. There we go. That's all the cab down on this side you can see it's completely black again I'd say compared to the other set um, the other ones are actually a bit more tighter so this is um, really good there's virtually no gap the little gap I've got there um, you can just move the fabric and cover it look that's brilliant and then the same on this window as well would be the same as fitting that um, and so guys I seriously i'll give these a thumbs thumbs up so guys if you want to buy a set of these from creative covers there'll be a link down in the description um, they are currently 60 pounds on their ebay shop um, and so check those out i'm going to hopefully do a few more videos quite soon the van is actually going very 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 quickly i'm going to be sad to see this go one of my friends is literally buying it next week um, so that's kind of a little bit sad but also excited that i'll free up a bit of money 
to start the next project, maybe probably tail end of this year. So it's going to be a little while. I've got a few other things I need to take care of. Oh, guys, I so very nearly forgot to tell you um, about how you can get your hands on this set for free. So the guys at Creative Covers um, very, very kindly sent me those. Um, I would generally, like I said in the video, I've given them a thumbs up. I'm actually editing the video there. Look, this is weird. You're watching me editing the video, but I'm in the video. How does that work? So they've said that I can keep these, um, but I want to give them away to someone as soon as we hit 5,000 subscribers. So the way you can do that is in this video. Um, please like the video. If you're able to share it, great. But make sure you've liked it and you subscribed. And if you're in the UK and you've got a T5, even better, could you put your name in the description and just tell me something that you love about sort of van life culture, about having a T5 or whatever you've got. If you've got a different van, it might not be worth entering because you'll have a set that are like custom cut for a T5, so it could be a bit odd. But yeah, just post up in the description kind of what you love about having a camper van, what you love about motorhomes, self-built vans, whatever it is, just give me a little quote. Um, and then what I'm gonna do as soon as we hit 5,000 subscribers, which should be actually around my 40th birthday. So looking at the statistics, um, early April, I won't give you the exact date, I'm gonna be 40. If we can hit 5,000 subscribers by then, what a great birthday present. I'll get in touch with whoever the lucky winner is and I'll post these to you for free and you can enjoy them in your van for the summer. So cheers guys. If you've liked this video, then please do give it a thumbs up. If you wanna enter the competition, give it a thumbs up. Please do make sure you're subscribed and I'm gonna make sure that I get a few more videos out now. Kind of the aim now is to tell you about how to build a van, where to start. So it's gonna be me talking a little bit more about kind of my experience having sort of done this van, seen it through the completion. The fourth van that I've done this one, please do keep an eye on the channel. There's gonna be a little bit more that will come. Um, and so guys, I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Cheers.